Hey everybody, this is Crazy with Crazy Gaming, and we're back for another episode of... We're back for another episode of Occupy Mars, Madman Hardcore Extreme, no tablets for 30 days. We are on Soul 17, which means we have 13 more souls to go. We have our plants growing out here, and they are almost done. So, the game plan for today is going to be this. We want to make a trip. I want to get a trip over to this place. And to do that, we need to travel out. Which means we are going to... Want to make our move. Looks like we have another base over here. I think we'll go for this water spot here. And we'll do that once everything's handled here before we leave, like the plants and such. We'll see what we got in here. Anything? No. Do we have seeds over here? No. So we need to go find some more seeds and whatnot. Let's make sure that everything is copacetic here. Okay, so we have it on supply. We have something in there. I thought I planted something when we were off camera. I did. I planted those beets. There was only four or five of them. They're at 19.83. So, we'll leave things the way they are. We had a solar storm as well. Once I was, just as I left the video last time, and so I went ahead and sped through all that, and I slept for a couple days, or I slept for one day to get through the solar storm and whatnot. That's how come these have grown so much. And so, let's go out. It's early morning. Oh, I want to see where our ATV charge is. Great, it's at 100%. I want to try and get, well, I want to try to get the materials and stuff so that we can. Equalizing pressure. External oxygen detected. Okay, where are we at on the glue and on this? 97. So maybe we can run over, establish the base, and then run back. Well, we're going to need all this stuff first. If we're not leaving without it, we're going to take it with us. Is that it? There it is. I see a base. Yep, looks like we got a base here. A damaged base. And we got one out in a bunch of the living areas out there as well. All right, let's see if we can get this done quick, fast, and in a hurry. So it's charging. That's all we care about. All right. Get a drink. Water refilled. Time is at 1543. We should be able to get back to the base. And we'll come back over here and start looting and doing our thing tomorrow.
alert. Oxygen depleted. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll do that here while we're here it's because we're already here. Put that back in our suit or we're forgetting to end up killing ourselves. All right, so we want to make some of these. Let's do inventory. Put that in there. Gotta make some of these. How many can we make? Probably need end up with eight instead of ten. I like to try to keep ten of these in my food at all or in my inventory at all times, but it is what it is. All right, let's get back over to the base. If we can build a solar panel that we could put this on, connect this to, and we can charge this thing up. We're going to build a food processor. We're going to need more power. External oxygen detected. I don't know if I got the materials. That should be under food. That's seed modification. That's not what I'm looking for. This is what I'm looking for. Sleep deprivation warning. Alert. Not enough materials. We're missing one electronic. I know where to get that. People under pressure. Low temperature warning. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We didn't get an electronic. People are good pressure. External oxygen detected. These have to be fully grown too. Yep, they are. What time is it? Ah. Uh, son of a beehive. Do I have my light on still? Yes, I do. All right, so let's see how much inventory we have. We got quite a bit, so we should be able to pick all these up. Available point for technological advancement. Oh, we got another one of those. Let's see. Tech points. Let's do the small crate. Botany. Technology access level increased. Tomorrow we'll be able to build that. First, we want to make some food. Sixteen thirty six fifty two eighty. So we're going to turn all of these into MRE so I can eat again because I don't like not having food. Available point for technological advancement. 
Funny foods. How you like me now? Let's see where these beets are. They're not going to be done yet. 35 cents. All right, we got food, we got water. We need to get another drink before we go to bed. And we should be able to sleep till morning. Low temperature warning. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Water refilled. People are under pressure. External oxygen detected. Okay. How do you like me now? Now we can sleep. Cracked helmet. Nope, no cracked helmet because we're not in the red anymore. <laughs> we need to turn that water off. Okay, so we're golden. Let's see what kind of shape these plants are in. 43, they're almost done. Need to get us a drink. People are under pressure. Water refilled. How much juice do we have left in this thing? Thirty six per cent. We could probably get back over to the base, but I'm not going to go over there yet. Instead, I'm going to come over here. See what we have with this. What's our charge look like? Hey, look at that. We're not empty like we normally are. So can we divert a little bit of power away from that? Let's see if we can't plug this in and get the charge going on it. That's insane. Oh my god, this thing. I really, 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 really hate this hitbox. Alright, so that's a charge a little bit. Let's go make sure that everything's okay in here. Okay, everything's rolling in here. What are we looking like here? 43. 44. Three, three, and this is how you deal with this stuff. Let's take a little nappy nap. That'll send us through the growth process, I think, and we'll be able to plant those beets out here in the field. In the let's see where these things are. There we go. Let's grab these things. Let's plant them over here.
Okay, so we've got the beets growing. We're at 16.29. Let's go out and get something to drink. People are good pressure. Water refilled. All right, what are we at on this thing? Look at that. It's almost 100%. Should be 100% by tomorrow. Grab some of these rocks and see if we can get lucky with some aluminum. That's silicon. Calcium, yeah, figures. I thought I saw a couple of lots here, so calcium. Are you kidding me? Aluminum. We need an aluminum stone. Somewhere out here. There's a woman. Calcium. Let's see what this is. People point for technological advancement. Calcium ore. Ooh. I'm going to definitely crack this stone up. Look at that. We'll be able to build another base. I like to build one over there by that. I'd like to build another workshop over there by that uh, alpha base. Because we could be there a while grinding, processing all that materials there. Because there's a ton of it. It's a lucky find here. Of that we got enough calcium now to build the second warehouse. A little bit of more. There we go. All right. So we should be good in every area except for oxygen. We'll do that right now. Equalizing pressure. External oxygen detected. External pressure dropping. Whatever floats your boat. Where are we at on these? Sixty one percent. That's fine. Pressure. 
Head back over to the base. Get ourselves a drink. Water refilled. Let's see what the battery looks like. Looking good. All right. Let's take our little ATV. Let's go scavenge some stuff. Got a bunch of solar panels here we can definitely take. Let's see what we got in here. That looks like a solar cell. Take the small circuit board, probably going to need it. Large solar cell, don't really need that. And the bolts, something right here, it looks like. Screws, whatever you want to call them. Call them screws, it looks like bolts to me. There's some food. I'll take that, and actually, I'm going to consume that because it's a higher ratio than mine. Yep, put us right up to full. What do we got over here? Electronics, we'll take that. Another small circuit board. Also, the inventory look. Looks like it's going to make it. Got some rocket fuel here. We'll take that because now that we have the explosive device, that'll come in real handy. I can see some food or something on the ground over here. Let's go. I was just standing here and I saw it when I looked this way. Ah, huh. that is too weird. Yes, maybe it was an optical illusion. See nothing else. Oh, there it is. Another food pack. We'll take it. And we are going to grind up all those parts, but for now, I want to go to the next base. Because I'm more on a food hunt and loose materials than on that stuff right now. Because we're going to get, we're going to be able to grind all that stuff up, but. I'd like to try to make a min and make a move to try to go to the other base today, but I don't think we're going to have enough time. I think it's going to be too late in the day. Because that place is a little ways from here. Not too far, but a little ways. Let's see if we go. Oh, there's another base back there. See, that's what I'm talking about. We got one over there. We got one right there. See what we can find in this one. I've got a helmet. Nothing here. That looks like a food pack. We walked right by it. Medium circuit board, not messing with that. Ah, more food. We'll take that. Steel plate. We'll take that. The food, yeah, coming up like that on the food, and it works for me. Oh, look at the hose, we can't interact with it. There's a tablet, I not see nothing else in here. Looks like we got more food. 
and rocket fuel. I'm doing pretty good on the food. Be nice if we found a seed pod here. Let's run around the outside, make sure we haven't missed anything. Can't see anything. I think we're all right. Yep, let's go to the next place. Look at the size of those solar panels. Those are the good ones. They're going to give us a lot of materials. We're going to stop and grind that stuff up. What time is it? Yeah, it is what it is. Looks like we got a container full of stuff. We'll see what we got in there. Uh, rocket fuel. Best way to do this is to grind these up as you go. Like another food pack. Oh, look at that. We're being the, the RNG guards are blessing us today with the food. And yeah, we're not gonna bother grinding that down. I want to go through here real quick and see what we can find. Well, oh, there's another food right there. Look at this. It's raining food today. we got here health bag not seeing anything in there nothing over here We'll take that. Nothing in there. Another food pack. <laughs> Can't believe it. Good lord. How much food do we have? Nine. And that's outside the ones that we made. Another food pack. That makes 10. These little baby solar panels, these little stubby solar panels. I don't see any food in them or anything. Looks like we got a chest right here. Electronics, steel plate, oh, 
Oh, two seed packs. Peppers and is that corn? No, that's one of those oxygen trees. Steel plates, some more food. Yeah, you take all that. This has something in it as well. Steel plates. It's in this building. Stuff under the ground. That stuff that's down there that we can't reach. What do we got up here? Looks like a food pack. A little cabbage. Another steel plate. Shoot. I'm going to look and see what was up there. Eventually, we'll come back here and grind all this stuff up, but for now, I'm not really interested in that. More seed back. Another apple. Food. See the stuff we should have gotten looks like it's under the the building. Probably the sleep deprivation warning alert. I didn't find the thing that trips me out is I did not find a tablet here. And like I said, there's stuff warning. for some reason there's stuff under the ground here. Inventory fill. Let's see what we got here. Lose the apple seed. Yeah. I don't really need those. I'd rather see what's in this one. Uh, this is just as bad. All right. Let's head back to the base. Low temperature warning. Go get a drink. Water refilled. Let's open up the door. How much charge do we have? 279. I don't know. We might be able to make it through the night with that. Thirty six to forty eight, nineteen to twenty four. That'll work. All right. All right. 
So all we got to do is make it till morning. And we'll be back as soon as it's daylight. Back in a sec. Okay, we're back. I decided to sleep in the chair because I also made a decision that we're going to head back to our base. Check on our plants before we head to the big place. As you can see, our stamina and health are greatly reduced. Low I'm sleeping in the chair. So what we're going to do is sleep in the bed when we get back to our base, and that'll bring us back to, to full health. How much power do we have? 37. I think we can make it back there. This much power. get this charging while we can. Blue branch, we need to close that and that and that. We need to go up here and we need to build us a transformer. Then we need to build us a battery pack. This damn machine, I swear to God, I'm going to kill it. See if we can get these as close as possible. How's that for close? for technological advancement another electronics point that we can't use because we still have that sprite 10 more days before we can use our our uh packs let's get these all opened up And last but not least, all right, let's juice, let's send all the juice over that way. Into the battery. Let's give it a chance to get itself together. 
All right, let's go see where our where our food's at. Yeah, they're still small. Eighty-one percent. We will be. Technological advancement. Pressure. External oxygen detected. Get a drink. Water rebuild. All right. Let's see if what's up, and we can add some more stuff here. Not enough materials. What are we short on? Small circuit board? I thought we had those. I we picked up some yesterday. Maybe not. Let's go store all this stuff. We'll go find one somewhere. External oxygen detected. What are these cabbage? I don't know if we can finish these in the field or not. I think they have, I mean, in the, I think these have to go in a greenhouse to get finished. There's our explosives. Let's combine those. Let's combine those. Swore we picked up a couple of small circuit boards. We must have used them when we were building that. Let's do our oxygen real fast while we're here. Just to top it off. Oxygen depleted. Really tough when you only have one oxygen bottle and one uh, water bottle. Let me tell you. All right. So it looks like we're doing okay. Forty-three solar panels. That's what I'm talking about. Okay, so we're at 13. Pickle, 65. Let's see what, what with those. It's got enough juice to... That's good enough. Let's go with that. Hopefully it'll be in charge in it. It's at 13%. we got to go find a small solar panel. I don't know where to do that. I do. We just can't do it yet because we don't have a charge in there over there. That's probably killing text that I'm eating. That's right. that into there. Let's move this under here. So we got plenty of med kits. All the stones around here, it's just insane.
Suit recharged. Sleep deprivation warning alert. Okay, so we got a sleep deprivation. We're going to fix that right now. Where is this at? At 20%. So we're going to need to sleep some time away. People are under pressure. We're at 1439. Let's make sure our hydration's full. People are under pressure. Water refilled. This refilled, so it should be good to go. People under pressure. External oxygen detected. So we'll sleep till the middle of the night, then we'll sleep the rest of the way into the day. That'll put us nine days away because that'll put us at solar 21. And it shoot. We're going to be running into a storm pretty soon, too. I would rather not be here when that happens. Okay, what time is it? It's 031. What's our water and hunger look like? Let's fix our hunger and let's go out and get some water. And if you'll notice, our health bars are back up full again. Low temperature warning. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Water refilled. Okay, so we should be able to finish sleeping now. Go the daytime. People are under pressure. External oxygen detected. Let's do a health thing real quick. That doesn't matter. That should put a pretty good charge on the ATV enough for us to run over and find us a small circuit board. Oxygen. 75%. The plant should be pretty close to full now. Ninety-five thirty-six. that's good enough. Go get us a drink. Low temperature warning. Water. Refilled. Okay, so we're all good on all fronts. Let's fill our oxygen up real quick and we will head out. Let's see what the power is on this side. It may not be all over. Oh, 100%. See, that's what I'm talking about. Let's grab this. Pop it right there. Now we have a permanent charging station here that we don't have to, to worry about any longer. Depleted. All right, what are these things now? Ninety five. But by the time we get back, they should be fully grown. We're going to go loot these bases over here. Pretty sure there's some solar panels on them. I mean, some small circuit boards in them.
66%. Wow. We really need that small acclimator. Okay, so we're going to need some more solar panels. And I think instead of... Yeah, we need to make another line right here. And all the way down the long. But I don't think I have enough cable to make it the rest of the way. Nope, we're out of cable. So we need to run and get some cable before we do that. Let's go ahead and fire this thing. Up to 100%. See where we're at on the charging now. We have 73.5, but that's going to go up to 75 as soon as we put in this next solar panel. Is another point. Yeah, maybe not. Now it should be better. Seventy-eight point four. That's better. Eighty would be more ideal, but it is what it is. All right. Let's see what our charge is on this new whopper. It's charging up. Let's go get a drink. Water refilled. Pressure. External oxygen detected. Before we do this, pressure. let's see what our power is here. So it's, it's fully charged, so we can go to 20 now. That should help speed things up on the charging. pressure. External oxygen detected. Okay, so these should be 100. They are. So we have this machine. We need to install the other one. Oops, not this. That machine is going to be under food. Let's build it. And hope it doesn't shut the power off. It didn't. Let's grab these. How much room we got in our inventory? We got enough. Available point for technological advancement. Oh, we got another one of those. All right. Where are we at? We have 20 of these. No bonuses. Amount of seeds is 20. Not bad for starting out with 5. So we're going to go ahead and put these in storage.
Let's save those for a rainy day. One thing though, we're going to have to bring this stuff with us for our trip. Hope that we come across some more seeds and whatnot. All right. Let's scavenge yeah, this. I'll get one more drink before we go down for the night. Same should be right there. 98, it will get charged in the morning. Before we leave. And we let it sleep to 429. Available point for technological advancement. But what soul are we on now? We're on soul 22. We have eight days left. I am going to make a judgment call here. I want to make this move being perfectly ready. No problems. thing close that thing is I want to be able to use my tablets all right let's go get some water this thing should be full it is like that. We're gonna go get a drink. Water refilled. Starts power looking like. Okay, so it's a little low. That's all right. I forgot to just put that back up. Let's charge our suit. Suit recharged. Put this back up to where it's supposed to be. Let's check and make sure that this thing is 100%. It is. 
All right, so let's get another drink. Water refilled. The only problem with doing this is we'll be here when the storm comes. And so today, we're not going to do that. We're going to head over to our other base. And when we get there, we're going to sleep two cycles. Then we're going to come back here. And in those two cycles, we should hit another storm. Next one will probably be dust storm. The last one was, or tornado. Because the last one was the that looks like uranium. It is. It got moved. That came off that rock over there. That's all right. We'll sleep two cycles here till we get through the storm. Then we'll head back over here. We will we'll transplant those beets. And then we will sleep a couple cycles there to grow those to full strength. Then we will process some of them for MREs. And we will... turn the rest of the seeds to take with us. Because we will be building another workshop over here next to the alpha base that we're headed to. There, like I said, there is a ton of resources there. It's amazing how fast this thing loses power in this short distance because of the fact we do not have the small accumulator unlocked. We don't have nothing unlocked yet for the blueprints. That's why I want to rush these last 10 days, try to get through them as quick as possible so that we can start using our tablets. I would have had the video made earlier this morning, but I'm having problems with the puppy. And I was up most of the night, and so I slept late today. So I apologize. We'll be doing another Madman stream this weekend. But I think tomorrow we may stream Tectonica. I didn't get a lot of views, you know, on that, on the video, the stream we made last time, or the video that I made, but it is 60, around 60 or 70 views, and that's good enough for me to do another one, and so if we do another live stream, maybe we can garner some more interest in that game. It's really a, a fun game, and it's it's pretty, you know, it, it's probably... Fairly close to Satisfactory, which is kind of cool, because I like the factory building games. So I think I'll push it on Saturday. So at noon on Saturday, we'll try to do a Tectonica stream, and then we're definitely going to go back to our Madman stream, hardcore stream, on Sunday. So if you're interested, come check it out. This weekend, I think we're going to do a solo Alright, what are we looking like on water and stuff? 
Water refilled. How are we looking on power? 68%. Probably try to plug this thing in. Do our oxygen first. We didn't do our oxygen back there. And I think we'll just disconnect this and connect it up to the... I don't know if closing this helps or not. Looks like our oxygen's almost full in here. Alert. Oxygen depleted. Most people use the uh, oxygen. Pressure dropping. I don't, because I don't trust the game. I've died too many times because, purely because of oxygen. All right, let's get this thing plugged up. See if we can't get it recharged real quick. You don't have to have power to sleep. Get as much sleep as we can. That'll put us into the dark, hopefully closer to the storm. It should be due any day now. Warning. Weather alert. Meteor shower expected. That's not good. Warning. Incoming meteor shower. Find wow. shelter. Warning. Now we can get damaged in here from a meteor shower. Warning. So all we can do is hope we get lucky and it misses us. But I'm glad it happened here and not over at our base. Oh, that was a close one. Warning. Definitely going to probably have to do some repairs because even though they landed far away, they have a tendency to... Do damage, even though they're hitting from the repercussion of them. That's over by that base. Is it over? Look at that. It's already over. Unbelievable. That was fast. Not getting the warning anymore. Come out here. Low Get temperature it. warning. Water refilled. Open up our thing and see if we have any damage on any of our stuff. Oh, looks like we missed it completely. Let's take the plug off of this thing, which is where it's at a hundred percent. Come on. Do some health kits. Okay, so we're full. Do our oxygen, man. I'm gonna have to do our oxygen. Let's see where our water is at. Hunger's full. Of water. Let's do some sleeping. Seven sixteens, as far as it's gonna let us go. Now I want you to look at my health bar when we, and my stamina bar when we stand back up. You'll see that they're a lot lower. They're about a third lower than they normally would be. 
Now my health and stamina both are down. I'm going to try to get it in an area where you can see it. You can't raise those up any higher than that because when you sleep in a chair, you lose that section. But when we go back to our base, what time is it? 7.19. When we go back to our base, we don't want to go there. We'll just do that little bitty pop. When we go back to the base and we sleep in our bed, we will be full again. You'll see that we we'll, would we'll, we'll be able to get those completely handled. Let's get a drink. Low temperature warning. Water refilled. Pop on the ATV. We're going to head back to the base. Now we'll go this way instead of over the hill this time. And when we get back to the base, you'll see what I'm talking about when I sleep in the bed. Those will come back up to full. Because that's the only way you can bring them back up to full. That's why I don't sleep in a capsule, and that's why I don't sleep in the in the landing capsule, because it does that. It doesn't matter if you sleep eight or ten hours. It, it, it you know, it doesn't it won't change it. It can't fix it. So it doesn't give you, it takes that away from you, deducts it from your total health and stamina, and it stays that way until you sleep in a bed again. No matter how many health packs you eat, or no matter how long you stand still. So just a heads up. But we will be making food while we're here this time, and we will sleep two or three days here before we leave and get those days, those souls down. So we're at, what, 23, so we have seven more. So if we sleep for a couple more days here, we'll be down to five, and then we'll be good. drive like I said come at noon on Saturday we will do a tectonica stream um, because that stream is going to be solo and not with my friend Katie we will not to say I won't be bringing her back again but we will definitely be doing a solo from scratch I've been playing the game all week, and I have actually reached the point where I'm making the blue orbs, and I have the explosives, and I have mined the landium ore, And I upgraded Victor Base a couple of times. But I, I've learned a lot of stuff in doing these playthroughs. And this, this playthrough on my own. And one of the th things I've learned is space management is huge. You know, we used a lot of space building the power structure for the orange or the pink or purple uh, orbs and we're not going to do that again it's it just becomes unbearable how much space that takes up and it takes away from being able to be, build a decent functioning factory and so we're not going to do it that way in this playthrough that we're going to do the solo playthrough and we may end up moving our solo playthrough to a weekday and doing the co-op week playthrough with Katie on Saturdays.
I have a number of friends who are um, content creators that are playing this game right now, and so it's a lot of fun. It really is. And it's quite challenging. As we know, we need to plug this in. We're just going from there to here, 68% off our stuff. Let's drink. Water refill. Honestly, thinking about adding another, even another, uh, oh, we're at 80. I'm honestly thinking about adding another, uh, transformer of stuff, but for now, we'll move it like it is. It seems to be working okay. All right. So, let's look and see where we're at with these guys. Okay, they're at 31%. So, what are we going to do? We're going to do our hunger. We're going to come over here and fill up our oxygen bottle. Alert. Oxygen depleted. I'm going to do one last thing. That's come out here. Charge our suit battery real quick. Suit recharged. Now we are going to take a drink. And then we're going to go sleep this whole day away. And so put us down to 24 souls. Water refilled. People are under pressure. External oxygen detected. Now, as you can see where my health and stamina is, that's as high as they go. But. We watch this. When I get up, they'll be full, both of them. Available point for technological advancement. We need to go drink. He won't let us do it without consuming water. Warning. People are under pressure. We only have an hour until the temperature drops. Water and, refilled. And as you can see, because I was over at the other base, the meteors did not affect this base. Temperature warning. Equalizing pressure. External oxygen detected. I'll leave the oxygen's fine. Sweet. Oxygen, 75%. Let's check our food and see what it's at. These guys are at planting time. All right.
It'd be nice when we get the crates. And we're going to work on building those today, I think. Ah, didn't mean to do that. Stupid. Where did it go? Oh, my God. Tell me I didn't lose it. in my pocket it will spoil where the hell did it go I don't see it I popped it into my pocket but yet I can't find it isn't that a bitch maybe it didn't pick it up I don't know maybe I put it back down nothing we can do about it now Last two. Get the water going. Tables are watering. Let's double check, and make sure we cleared everything. Check our inventory again. Yep, it's not in here. So there you go. All right. What time is it? It's 8:44. Let's do our oxygen. get a drink.
Okay, so we're at 1843. Let's go out and drink. Take a lot of pressure. Let's see what this thing is. It's at a hundred percent. Let's actually unplug here. No, we don't need to do that. I'm gonna go over here. Oh, we can't. Can't charge because it's dark. But we do have to do it here. Let's put this back where it's supposed to be. We would should be able to charge here. Suit recharged. There we go. Pick this back up. Plug me back in. Let's go get one more drink before we head inside. We can get the longest sleep possible. Water refilled. Good pressure. Where are these things at? They're at 58.8%. Sleep. Warning. Oxygen, 75%. Okay. We'll get a drink. Low temperature warning. Water refilled. Charge our suit. Recharged. See where our food's at. External oxygen detected. Sixty six. Alert. Oxygen depleted. Available point for technological advancement. All right, let's get a drink. Oops, 
take it out of its nest first. Alert. Oxygen depleted. Not gonna close that door. Let's see where the food's at. 73, one more night and we should be good. Water refilled. Suit recharged. Okay, so we are on Soul 26, which leaves us four days, and we'll be able to start using our tablets. The food should be pretty close to being done. Eighty-three percent. Oh, we didn't put our oxygen back in. Lucky us. Ha! <laughs> Fuck. The only reason we didn't die because we were in an oxygenated area. Suit recharged. Get a drink. Water refilled. People are good pressure. External oxygen detected. These things are at eighty four per cent. One more night, low soul are we on? Soul 26. One more night, it'll do us. Food will be fully grown. We'll be able to process it. And if we're lucky, we won't get a storm in the night. If we do, it'll either be dust devils or a tornado, I believe. We'll get a drink. People are good pressure. Still have time to charge our suit battery. Water refilled. Suit recharged. People are good pressure. External oxygen detected. Alert. Oxygen depleted.
Okay, where is this stuff at? 91.9. It will be full when we wake up in the morning. And sometimes these storms come right, right as we're getting up. Warning. There's definitely going to be one tonight or sometime today. So what I'm going to do is, is process all this food. Oh, it's not full yet. Take it to 750. Available point for technological advancement. Okay, where are we at? Fully grown. Okay. What's our inventory look like? Yeah, it's not too good. I don't know if we can hold all that. Let's put this stuff over here. To be able to hold it all now. Let's pick it all up. Make sure we're not over doing it. Nope, we're doing good. Okay, we got everything shut off. Where's our processor? There it is. So what is the total that we have? We got 80. I'm gonna split that. I'm gonna split it again. I'm going to put 20 in here. And we're going to keep the rest to process. Oxygen, 75%. We got enough that we can plant when it's time. Oops. Come over here. Splits. Thirty-six, thirty-eight, not bad. Available point for technological advancement. Right, so we got ourselves all loaded up on food.
Not as good as the stuff up there, but plenty good. I'm going to swap these out, save the good stuff for last. Let's go ahead and open this up. Let's take this, 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 and this, and this. All right. The time is at 9.45. We'll get some water. Okay, we got us our hunger sandled. People are good pressure. External oxygen detected. Alert. Oxygen depleted. Trying to get this done. Before I end this episode, I know this seems crazy, but hey, can I say? We will be going through another storm tonight, so we need to be aware of that. Water refilled. Make sure our suit's all charged. Suit recharged. Okay. We are good to go. All right, except for one thing. I want to make those crates. So we'll have them when we get over there. If we can. There they are. Do we have the stuff? Yes, we do. Can we make two? Can we make three? Nope, we can only make two. Is what it is. Where are the crates at? Oh, they're slow. We'll have two crates. That's going to help us out a lot when we get ready to start planting stuff at the next place we're at. We'll head back to the campsite. We'll probably spend a night there before we head over to the big place. We want to make sure we have all the materials we need to make the next workshop. This is going to be a problem. What could we do? How about we do this? Okay, so we got everything we need. We won't be back here for a while. Let's grab the... Did we do it? Already, yeah. Okay, let's head back to the campsite. I won't go. I'm going to end the video here, and we're traveling back to the campsite. I will not be traveling to Alpha Base until the next video. We'll do that together. Um... It's been a long stretch here. We're on Soul 27. We only need three more days. And we'll be eligible to use our tablets. Which are going to be huge for us. Because it'll change things quite a bit. This base here will probably be 
collect dust, they would be forgotten. We may come back and scavenge stuff and pick it all back up and bring it over to where we're at to expand the base we're going to be building at Alpha Base, which is where our new home base is going to be. <clears throat> that being said, hopefully you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to leave comments. Let me know what you think. We appreciate you. Also, <clears throat> if you hit the like button, like the video, it helps us. We appreciate you. That makes our videos more visible on YouTube. Also, if you're not subscribed, make sure you hit that subscri subscription button. And we appreciate that as well. And as you can see, we have enough subscribers to become monetized, but we chose not to do that because it's not about money for us. It's about just enjoyment. I'm retired and this is my hobby and I really like it. That being said, I've been a gamer for years since the first games came out. I'm, I'm old enough that games that I played growing up were only found in arcades. We didn't have consoles. We didn't have computers. So there you have it. Anyways, also hit that, that bell so you can get notification we drop that next video. In the description of the video and all my videos is a link to our Discord. Don't hesitate to click on that link, accept the invite, and enjoy our Discord with us. The disc, we, in, we do do game giveaways every once in a while. We gave a, a copy of this game away, and we also just did four giveaways of the copies of Tectonica, the other game that we're kind of playing right now. Don't forget, on Sunday is our Madman Hardcore Extreme. No tablets for 30 days. Man, that's a mouthful. Um, that's our stream on Sundays at noon Pacific time. Come join us and watch the stream. We always have a good time. My buddy Tex jumps in the, our Discord with us and talks as we play the, the game. Also, um, my friend Katie plays co-op with me on tectonica we did a stream of that last sunday um we're bringing the madman back to sundays because that's where it's always been and then i think on saturdays we're going to point for technological advancement we're going to be doing uh, another live stream of tectonica we'll do that co-op with katie and then somewhere during the week i think and probably wednesday we will do a live stream of um tectonica solar anyways that being said hopefully you enjoyed this video like i said and we look forward to having you back this is crazy with crazy gaming see you in the next one bye for now